Ice box, which uh, originally I intended to do yesterday as I was actually out ice fishing up in Aurelia on Lake Kuching. We got out for about an hour before the Canadian Ice Fishing Expo in Barrie, and uh, it was a fun day. Didn't get into any fish, unfortunately, but just to be able to scratch that itch and get out on the ice felt amazing. And uh, I actually did a full unboxing out on the ice, got home, and audio was just corrupted. I don't know what happened, if uh, something was on the mic or something happened anyway. And basically I can't use that footage, but just do a quick run through right here. Check it out. box see what's inside I've actually opened a few of the lures to try them out yesterday and uh, the action on them is really fun it was fun trying them all out and I uh, had a couple marks just couldn't get any hook sets it's a little bit early I've never actually been in the spot we went to yesterday so it was a, a learning experience for me but it was great to look inside the box and uh, let's get into it take a look what you can get if you get on to simplefishing.ca and get this box ordered there's still some left so uh, make sure you get it quick all right, so we're just gonna open her up. I've already been through it, like I said. So a lot of this stuff is actually already open, but nonetheless, we're gonna go through it. It's a little bit windy. Hopefully the audio is not too bad. But basically you get your card. It's got a list of all the pricing on it. Everything you're gonna need to know, all the websites and everything to check out the information on these products. But just a quick look right away. There's a bunch of great stuff in here. Fun to use some lipless cranks, some tubes, some vertical jigs. It is windy, so we're gonna move the box and get right into the lures. All right, so the first bait we're going to get into is the Northern Lights Lure Company Spectra Vibe. This thing is a great swim bait, lipless crank bait. It's got a nice rattle to it to get that audio attraction up in there. And the nice thing about this thing is the belly actually changes color. So I got a warm water right here. We're gonna drop that in and uh, see if that belly's gonna change. Get that on the video here. You see the red just kind of disappeared right there, giving it a completely different look. So in the warm water, you're gonna get more of this style of bait look, and the colder the water gets, that red belly's gonna appear. So I'm gonna take it out, and I'm sure even just being out of the water, you're gonna see that come back. It gives it a kind of a bloody appearance, like a wounded bait fish. So if you keep this thing nice and warm and toss it in some cold water, you're gonna get a variety of colors going through this thing, and the fish are gonna be like, what's going on? I wanna eat it. Get that rattle going. It's three inches, so you're gonna get some nice pike probably with this, maybe in some lake trout. It was fun to play with yesterday, and uh, I really like that color changing action on this thing. Definitely a nice one in the box. Another great addition to the Simple Fishing RLM Elite Ice Box is the Dynamic Lures HD Ice. It's got a great color on it, the bubblegum pink and uh, nice stripes, a little bit of orange on the belly. Night looks really good in the light under the ice. You're gonna be able to see it down there 20, 30 feet down. Still gonna have a nice color and shape to it. You're gonna get in some walleye with this, probably some perch and a lot more. It's gonna be a nice multi-species lure. And I got a chance to try it out yesterday. It looked great in the ice to me. Unfortunately, I couldn't get anything on it, but nonetheless, the season is still early. And I think this one is gonna be a great game changer for my season this year. Staying with the lipless cranks, we have the Coppers Live Target. This is the Golden Shiner. This thing just glows in the sunlight with a beautiful golden color. It's got a nice rattle to it. So it's great, deep, shallow, whatever you want to fish this thing. You're going to get into some 
awesome fish. It's going to be a great multi-species lure for pike, for lake trout, for big perch, walleye, whatever you want. You're going to get into a lot of great stuff and I can't wait to get out this season and try this one a lot more. I had it on yesterday. The vibrations it sends out in the water are just crazy and uh, it's going to be a great attractant. So another beautiful lure in the box. This next lure is the biggest one in the box. It is the Freedom Minnow. This was five inches and it's the silver shad color. I love these things. I have a few of them in my box, but this one's by far the biggest. You got that nice red bead on there, which creates a nice clicking sound. And the beauty of the thing with this is you actually tie your line right here. So it has a beautiful climbing action as it drops and falls. It kind of has a nice wobble to it. And again, that bead is just gonna give a clicking sound as well as it look that it's wounded. And you're gonna get into some big fish with this, probably some beautiful pike. I can't wait to get out to my favorite pike spot. Throw this one down. It's gonna be a deadly lure. My favorite thing about the RLM Elite boxes is those surprise baits that you may have never heard of or tried out before. Like this one here is the Crazy Hick Bait Company. The little ball-tailed grubs. These things are gonna be amazing in the water for perch, for crappie, for sunfish, bluegills, any of those small little panfish. They throw these on a micro jig head, get that down the hole, and they're gonna gobble these up all day. The little ball tail is gonna create some great action and the grub just looks delicious. This one's gonna be a really fun one to try from the Crazy Hick Bait Company. Check them out. One of my favorite things to fish for through the ice is perch and this Vexen Crystal Reaper is gonna be a great one to use this year. It's an awesome vertical jig with that tail on there. It's gonna create a nice figure eight darting pattern that's just gonna be a lot of chaos under the ice for perch and probably even some pike and i've even caught a whitefish on a similar style bait than this it's got a nice little kind of bead on the treble hook there for a lot more visual attractant the fish are going to want to come up and inspect that see what's up and by the time they got that in their mouth boom it's going to be too late this one's going to be a great one to try and i think i'm going to have it on my line quite a bit this year so far in my ice fishing career, one fish I have not been able to get through the ice has been a lake trout. And being a Lake Simcoe fisherman, it kind of hurts my soul a little bit that I'm going on my third season targeting them and I still haven't got one through the ice. But this bait is something I think is going to help me out quite a bit this year. The Pro Series X-Zone Lure and it's the white tubes. You can't go wrong with a white tube. Kind of looks like a wounded bait fish, like a herring or something that's kind of been puked up by another fish. Got some great quarter ounce tube jigs as well. So you're gonna throw this together. It's gonna be a deadly combination. Whether you're fishing deep or shallow, you're gonna get into quite a bit of different fish with this. And uh, I think it's gonna be a big help to my fish this year. Something else that's fun that came in the box are these chum pucks. There was actually two of them. This is the crawfish scent and there was also a garlic scent which I got to try out yesterday. And uh, basically what it is, is just a visual attraction, audible scent. It's a uh, 100% biodegradable and earth friendly materials. And basically you just drop it down the hole and it just creates a lot of bubbles and floating whatnot. Basically a chum down below. So if you're having a tough day, getting the fish to come in or you just can't find them you don't know what the patterns are you can throw one of these down and it should be a big help at least to get something into the area to kind of inspect what's going on and something fun to try again something that you may not think of but when you get the rlm elite boxes it's a full of surprises the last thing i'm going to show you out of the box isn't in every box it was available for the first 30 orders it's the freedom turn back shad and last year i got to use it for the first time it quickly became one of my favorite baits to use in my taco box and i'll tell you why this thing has a center pin so it actually kind of spins around and when it's in the water it kind of darts across and then turns back it comes back around just like that and creates a lot of commotion in the water fish are going to get annoyed by it and want to eat it up get it out of their territory it's got the nice red bead on it to simulate a wounded bait fish, but it also kind of gives it a nice rattle sound as you're jigging it across. It's an 
all metal design, so it's super strong, great hook on it. So you're gonna be able to get into tons of different fish, whatever, whatever your multi-species favorites are, pike, perch, walleye, this thing is gonna be an awesome one. And it was a great addition to the box and I'm glad I was able to get one of the first 30 ones and glad to be able to share it with all of you. That wraps up the Simple Fishing RLM Elite Ice Box unboxing. And it was fun to do it. I wish it would have turned out yesterday while I was on the ice. But nonetheless, you got to see all the great stuff inside. And you can still get one. Head on over to simplefishing.ca and check them out. As well as the walleye, pike, bass, and multi-species boxes that are also available. And while you're checking out, use my promo code OUTDOORDAVE to save 15%. And there's still little bit of time to get it before Christmas but you have to order by December the 10th so if you can get it by then you might get it on your doors by Christmas if not a late gift never hurt anybody so check them out simplefishing.ca check them out on Facebook and Instagram and while you're there check me out too Outdoor Dave until next time we'll see you later